welcome back to my channel please welcome to my space this is the noble space karibuni asante do not forget to subscribe for those who have not yet subscribed please ako ka button manze ni free it's only free ako ka button ka kwapo ka meandikwa re subscribe ka kuze tu ivo tu just that alafu next uki kuza mwa kata tokelezia ka bed just kuza ako ka bed it's free free of charge so that you won't miss out on any time we post now today we are going to talk about the remedies of low self esteem yeah guys we are here and do not forget this is a channel where we declutter renovate and allow god to mold us to what he has called us to be amaniaji and of course becoming the best version of us is our core mission and our core goal this is my space where it's all about positivity and point number one after you have gone through knowing the root causes of so low self-esteem after you have gone through knowing if you have low self-esteem you can go uh, watch my there's a video on signs of low self-esteem you can go back there and please watch it suffer daily you can watch it you can be able to relate well with this one now point number one if you have gone through the signs it is not you might have like Three or four, but and you feel kapisa kapisa. Please just point number one go see a professional help, a psychiatrist. Please let us be in the 21st centuries where, where we don't have to, like, I know psychiatrists <laughs> most of the time when I to uh. Oh my god the, the name has escaped the name shrink shrink oh please tell me the name of a uh, the the kaslang name of a psychiatrist hapo chini hapo kwa comments hapo pale akiniambie niambie ile tu akimanzi sikumbuke anyway point number 1 go see a professional help if really 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 you feel you need to to see one please do also you can see you can you can walk you can look out on a, a life coach a life coach life coach also can help you they are not psychiatrists yet like me but they can be able to overcome you because sometimes when i talk about this it is because i'm just telling you what i have been able to do i'm just telling you what i i have been doing it has really helped me to overcome my and to boost my self-esteem and now i'm good guys now point number two exercise 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 and i don't mean if you're not like a, a fitness uh, enthusiast come on me, me like when you, you don't mind waking up in the morning going for a run or in the evening going for a run or having to just do some small exercises it helps you it helps yeah. when you exercise there is a, a hormone called juicer or something something that causes to, uh, that releases uh the feel good hormones the happy hormones our sound so they help you and the moment you feel happy you feel nice you feel nice Cindy, you feel very 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 nice <laughs> now you don't have to do a lot you don't have to do a lot if you can just buy a rope do some se several ropes just several like like 20 or very fast one once you do it there's like a good feeling that comes and also you can do some evening walks just after you after you get home from work you can just go for a, for a walk don't walk slowly just walk very a bit faster so that you can be able to sweat it helps it really helps also you can decide to run also you can decide to do if you you're good with push up do some several push up do, just something just do something you don't have to be like so much uh so much like you have to do like for an hour no just for 10 minutes in the morning 10 minutes in the evening if it's a walk like just 20 minute walk a 20 minute walk in the evening and in the morning and guys i'm telling you that help point number point number three balanced eating healthy 
and sleeping in it. Uh, once you deprive yourself of sleep, first of all, it will it really affect your mood. When you don't sleep a lot, you feel grumpy. I don't know. It's it's is that the is that really the right the right word? You feel grumpy or something like that. You una feeling like you're not so good, you're not so well, you feel sickly and all to this. And of course if you when you're feeling that your emotions are all over the place and of course at during that time if someone tells you something very small it really gets into you and it starts doing some very not so good things inside your heart and <laughs> inside your heart and everything and also eat balanced diet guys eat balanced diet and i told you in the other video you don't have to like uh, burn out your pockets because of eating healthy thank we thank god because right now we have like uh, everything is available to us everything is available to us make sure or oh, once you when you're eating in any in any Food you're eating make sure it's a balanced diet make sure you have protein you have make sure you have uh, vegetables and starch of course uh, and a fruit make sure at least you eat fruits if you can't afford like every other day different ones you can decide to be eating just one type of a fruit every day like if you, monday you eat an orange you, tuesday you can eat a, a melon wednesday you can eat a pineapple thursday you can eat a popo and apple is very nice by the way for those guys who uh, have issues those people who have, have issues with acidity in their stomach trust me a popo is a very 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 good remedy if you eat it on, a, on, on an empty stomach and also watermelon if you eat it on, a, on an empty stomach it really helps do not eat orange do not eat acidic fruits when you are hungry if you're feeling hungry do not eat an orange do not eat a pineapple do not eat a banana when you're on a when you have not eaten anything guys please for those fruits you have to eat something so that the mo the moment they bring in the acidity it will find something to it find something to mix up everything up and go sour sit down point number four practice self affirmation self-affirmation is telling yourself things that you would want other people to tell you like for example tell yourself you're beautiful tell yourself you're you are able tell yourself you're capable to do anything tell yourself that you're strong you are brave you are everything god created you to be just tell yourself all those things it really helps to you for you to you can write all the positive things about you in a paper make sure you post you 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 put it somewhere uh you put it somewhere that you'll be able to sit every day and practice to before you get out of the house make sure you tell tell yourself those things and guys i'm telling you i have been doing this and i know they work of low self-esteem you're not able to say no a lot so from now and forth assess and any situation before saying yes if it's a friend who wants to be helped assess the situation is it necessary is it a must is it, is it a life and death situation that you have to help them is it something that they can do without is it something that will uh that will overwork you? is it something that it is going against your standard and against what you believe or against it is exhausting you if it is going beyond all those things guys just assess it take some few minutes you have the right it is you it is their your your effort they want it is your help they need so if, if you don't feel adequate to give it just say no now do not please do not be sorry about it do not apologize for not feeling like doing something that you did not feel like doing it if you don't feel like going anywhere you guys I tell you for me even just coming from where I've come from and stay inside in my house and just take a nap I am busy that is busy for me just taking a nap is busy for me because I'm trying to rejuvenate I'm trying to like relax because and uh, exhale everything yeah once you sleep you forget things 
could have like to be really really busy busy kapita at least so that you can tell someone <laughs> that you're busy like even sleeping if you want to sleep like then sleep and just say no you they, you they want you to take they want you to take them somewhere just say no tell them you're busy but you're busy sleeping or busy just sitting around in the house now uh, another thing set goals set goals if for example you've been wanting to be consistent on something like for example you're not the kind of person who makes their bed in the morning when they wake up and you really want to just make it a priority like once you wake up you know some some people say that you know i'm going to come and no from now hence more just to wake up before you move out of that bed make it and stick it somewhere in your notebook or your diary just stick it and like congratulate yourself hey, tell yourself d today you made the bed it looks very nice so that's all or other thing if you have been wanting if you have been wanting maybe for example you you you, you want to lose weight you want to lose weight just set a goal just set a goal and say that from around 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 three or around four in the evening i won't take any starch just take proteins uh, uh, and vegetables or fruits just that you can say i will try with like three days and once you're able to go through th- those three days congratulate yourself tell yourself girl you've done it mama you've done it like for three days we've done it evil evil now in case you're not able to fulfill it do not beat yourself up do not self criticize yourself please do not do that just pick up yourself pick it pick up from where you left and you move like you continue you don't have to beat yourself you appreciate yourself point number seven is always pamper you do those things that you love doing they make you they really help you feel good like for example if you if you love food if you love eating if you love food come on, mimi. <laughs> if you love food come on, mimi. papa yourself like you don't have to wait for anyone to take you don't have to like just take yourself somewhere sit yourself down order kula Shiba, Liba, Toka Wende. It really feels nice. Sawa, sawa, guys. Please appreciate yourself. Pamper yourself. If you love it, if you love exercising, please exercise. If you love doing everything, just to do it. And do not mind what people are saying, what they are doing. Sawa, sawa. Now, top 10 criticism. Once you fail on something, you have to understand that you will never be perfect. You will never be perfect. But you are made perfect in our weaknesses. And it only through Christ. Sawa sawa guys. So do not self criticize. Once you fail on something, do not call yourself foolish. Do not call yourself uh, all the names that you call ourselves. Do not call yourself that. Sawa sawa guys. Please do not. Do not call yourself that. Because you are more than that. And the last always pray about it once you wake up in the morning just pray about it tell god god help me holy spirit help me that my self-esteem will be high because of god we have to be confident we have to be confident in things of god and always pray see you to another next time for more if you would want to know something please if you have any question just have a chini kwa comment section just ask it let's meet there i will be glad any question that you want to ask i'll be glad do not forget to subscribe